Today I'm making pastries filled with Circassian cheese. The Circassian cheese, a semi-hard, lightly salted cheese, has a very dominant part in the Circassian kitchen. It's made mainly in our village boutique dairy, but it could easily be prepared at home. I add it to two of my pastries. One is topped with eggplants, roasted peppers, onions and cherry tomatoes. The second is with baked tomatoes, garlic and olive oil. We're in Kfar Kama, located in the Lower Galilee. Kfar Kama is a Muslim Circassian village that was established in the late 1800s by Circassian immigrants who came from the Caucasus Mountains. We opened Danul Cafe right by the Circassian Heritage Center, inside an ancient building that served as a fabric store until recently. I've been baking since I was a kid, so for me, opening the bakery was a dream come true. I could never imagine I would achieve it at the age of 20. What helped me do this was the help and support from my family. Both my sister and mother work here with me. I think we're bringing something new and refreshing to the village. It's the first place to offer fresh pastries every morning. I don't work with a fixed menu. It changes daily according to my inspiration and to the seasonal produce. Almost all the ingredients I use are grown locally. The olive oil is made by my grandpa, and the spreads and jams are homemade. I also tend to include in my pastries traditional Circassian elements, like special spices or the cheese. But I think that what actually makes this place unique is the Circassian hospitality, which is particularly welcoming and warm. Add the pastries to it, and this is what the place is all about. Or, you're trying to make a comment.